Sound like that. No, you're right. I haven't nailed it yet. But don't you worry, Mrs. Sandoval. I'll get it. <laughs> okay, meanwhile, why don't we start the math puzzle? Why don't we start the math puzzle? <laughs> oh, yes, please. Yeah, I think Proceed. we have to keep working mm. on it. Yeah. Now, Jeannie, this mm -hmm. puzzle's a little bit different. We're given a tally chart, and we are asked to write our own question about the tally chart. Oh, how exciting! Mm -hmm. Now, let's see what they give us. Well, we have number of children who yes. chose t-ball as their favorite sport, hmm. number of children who chose soccer as their favorite sport, oh. and number of children who chose swimming as their favorite sport. Mm -hmm. Now, let's talk about what the tally marks represent. Tally marks represent... Mm -hmm. No, that's not it either. <laughs> <laughs> this is how we show five with tally marks. Oh, yes! Mm -hmm. See, yes. we have one, two, three, four, and then five. Five. So, five students chose T-Bond. Now, we know already this is five. Mm -hmm. Five. Five. Six. Six. Seven. So five, six, seven, seven chose soccer. Right. And one, two, three, three children chose swimming. Oh, I love swimming. Now, mm -hmm. what can we ask? Remember, we have to come up what with a question. What can we ask? Hmm. I got it. I, you got it. Yes. What if we ask? Yes. How many children chose T-ball and swimming? Oh, that's a good I question. Like that question. Yes, me too. Okay, now if we're trying to find the number of children who chose T-ball and swimming, that means we have to add. 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 Very yes, good. Yes. yes. So where is my T-ball? Here's my T-ball. Five yeah. children mm -hmm. plus three plus mm -hmm. three, right? Is equal. to... Two, eight. So, five plus three equals eight. Eight children chose t-ball and swimming. T-ball and swimming. Now, oh. mm -hmm. now, Jeannie, this is not the only question that we can come up. There's so many. So, maybe you chose a different question. Did you? Can you think of a different question? Um. Hmm. Hmm. I got oh. it. Ready? Yes! Here's the next question that we can come up with. Okay. Which sport did the fewest children choose? Oh, it's a good, good one, one, right? One. Yeah. Yeah. Now, let's see. I'm just going to organize my information a little bit better down here. Okay, I we like know. It. Thank you. We know that five children chose T ball. Yes. Seven chose soccer. Mm -hmm. Now, Five is less than seven. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. And we're trying to find the fewest. Mm -hmm. okay. So we're going to look at now five and three. Okay. Now, three is less than five. So the fewest children chose... Swimming! Swimming! Oh, oh that was fun! But, you know, um, I best be getting back to my rehearsing. Shall I say goodbye to the boys and girls? Allow me! Have fun with math, everybody. See? I told you I'd nail it. <laughs>
Is that really how I sound? Oh, don't worry about it. Nobody likes the sound of their own voice. <laughs> Except me, of course. <laughs> oh, la, 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 la. <laughs> 